Uh, so who have I got? Yes. Oh, yeah. So, you, yeah. Left footed. You've got two ways to win again. He's too good at this, isn't he? I do. Um, mate, I can, picture, I can picture him walking out of my packs. I can picture his face. He's, He's the one who got foot. the bottle thrown at him. At the, uh, well, the cop anyway. At the match. Football team game is absolutely free. The link is down below. You do get an extra 2,000 energy when you do join through my link. And as you can see, we've got one space in the team at the minute. I might be looking to release a couple of players, to be honest, because I think we've got a few that haven't uh, turned up to training and stuff like that. You know, they're not putting in the hours, basically. You know, it's, it's, it's poor. We need, we need players with real dedication to the team to uh, ensure we get the wins that we need. So uh, I think I will be knocking off a couple of those players if they're not playing recently. And uh, yeah, as you can see, we have beaten... I don't know if you know Sim too. Uh, he makes FIFA videos. Um, he has been on FIFA Connect as well. Uh, but we did beat him 10-0, which is a bit embarrassing, to be frankly honest. Such delicacy on that pass. So if you want to join the team, make sure you do join the link down below and I'll see you on the pitch. Hello and welcome to Footy Tic Tac Toe, the series in which you are mashing up two different things and finding a player that has that in common. And today we are joined by Plute. How are you doing? Hello, mate. I'm doing good. Thanks for having me on. I'm excited. It's uh, very interesting to get somebody from, well, now a championship team in Leeds United. You'll have some uh, different knowledge for sure. Yeah, I was ready for that. I mean... We are a championship club now, I've got to accept it. But yeah, I'm definitely going to try and get Leeds in there mm -hmm. as much as possible. Mm. Yeah. Has uh, Daniel Farker, has he been confirmed yet or is it still... I mean, that, yeah, there's talks. To be honest, mate, since the relegation, I've tried to like switch off from it because <laughs> I just, you know, once we've got a manager, that's when we can start looking at mm -hmm. a direction, getting players in. People are yeah. saying, Plute, who are you going to sign? I don't, we haven't got a manager yet. Yeah, yeah, we need a manager you know to know what he wants. Yeah. So, um, yeah. Yeah. Well, well, we'll have to wait and see. I'm sure you'll do well next season in the Champions League. Norwich Although fans, is... they speak highly of Fox. So yeah, we'll yeah, we'll he, did, he did do well with them. Um, the Championship, though, next season is ridiculous. When you look at the actual quality of teams, there's about there's probably like Rotherham, Plymouth, and there's like one or two more that aren't going to be... And even they could, you know, miraculously yeah. get into the playoffs. But everyone else could probably... Maybe it's like a Preston as well. They're not too good. Uh, but yeah, let me just stop slandering championship teams and uh, go into today's episode. Um, let's do it. What would you let's like to start it. off with as a club or national trophy? Can I get Leeds United in there, please, mate? Yeah, why not? Yes. Let's start with them. I will go with Valencia. Let's go for Spain nation. I will say Juventus. Um, shall we throw in a PSG? Top yeah, right. why not? I'll end up with a bit of a smaller team in Middlesbrough. Championship right. knowledge in there. Yeah. Uh, you get to go first. What would you like to fill in on the grid? Um, Leeds Valencia is just perfect for me. My favourite Leeds player ever, Pablo Hernandez. Let me grab the shirt. You think we go uh, Rodrigo? Pablo <laughs> Hernandez, Pablo. mate. There's the shirt. My that. favourite ever yeah. Leeds player. I love him. Yeah, he was quality for you. And Swansea as well. Like, yeah. he's, uh, Is he still playing or has he gone to Spain? I I think he, he went to the Spanish second division for a little bit. Uh, he's probably about 37 now, but he's one of those yeah, players where on. they don't need pace because they're so smart, do you know what I mean? So mm -hmm. he's probably still doing a bit. Yeah, just a uh, quality player. I do know one for Boring Leeds, uh, Mark Viduka. Oh, mate. What a player. He needs a hero card for Australia. I agree. You I know. think a Viduka hero card would be great for FIFA. Mm -hmm. He'd be a big bulky striker and I'd enjoy scoring yeah. a few headers with him. <laughs> Great player. What would you like next? Hmm, let's have a think. So this can be past and present as well, right? Yeah, any any time, literally any time they've played for like any of the clubs and whatnot. I'm trying to think of any Spanish Juve players. I've got one. Um Spanish Juventus. Who was that big tall striker? What was his name? Fernando Lorente. Ooh, Fernando Lorente, yeah. Yeah, there's two of them. There's Lorente and there's Morata, you could have also said. Oh, yeah, the, of course, uh, of course. The journeyman. Um, so I need to stop you at PSG and Borough. Oh, oh, that is tough. Let me have a think. Problem is, I don't think I'll, I'll be able to think of anyone. Mm. To be like a Frenchman or something. Might even have to go back to like 2000s, kind of when Middlesbrough in the... Um, yeah, in the Premier. Like yeah. Europa League. Yeah, in the Premier as well. I'm just trying to remember the old, yeah, just, I'm, I'm thinking like someone like Jimmy Floyd Hasselbank, that kind of, mm. yeah, what else did be... they have? I'm trying to Ooh, think of did, like early um... PSG players. I'm going to try Juninho, Alista. Oh, that's a shell, that is, that's a yeah. shell. 
I don't know if he... Um, I want to say he was Leon, though, not PSG, but let's have a look. One of the greatest ever free kick takers. Did he play for yeah. PSG? That's the question. It's got Atletico Madrid, Celtic, Palmeiras, but no PSG, unfortunately. Oh, that's a good shout. Yeah. Mate, that's a tough one. Um, so if you know one for Borough and PSG? I just don't, mate. I just don't. Yeah. I'm trying to think. But I'll give me some time here. Um, I mean... I think I'm going to play it easy. I can't think of any bar of PSG. So let's go Spain, Valencia. Just go for Danny Parejo, the ultimate fodder player on FIFA. <laughs> if I Is could... that uh, Villarreal now as well? So that was his previous club. Yeah, yeah. Um, I always get mixed up between Valencia and Villarreal. Just so very similar. Uh, PSG, Valencia then. Goncalo Guedes. Wow. Portuguese. Yeah. Nice. A little time. It's uh, PSG on loan. You've cut me off there. Well played. Yeah. Although you can get Boris Spanish. Yeah, that might be. Mate, Boris just a tough one. Like I can't even mm. think of anyone. I've got one for this. Mm. See, I see the last two. Well, the last three years that he's been in the Premier League, I've sort of switched off from the Championship, so I can't really. Yeah. Well, to be fair, these ones will end Borough and the Prem. Mm. You'll know. Well, I think you know all three of the names. To be fair, it's just whether you know they played for Borough or not. Come on, Plute. Use that big head of yours. Oh, mate. The comments right now are going, oh, I know this guy. Span Spanish for Lin uh, Spanish Borough. Spanish. I've got to get a Spanish Borough player, mate. I just can't think. Did Mendieta play there? I can't think. Did he play for Borough? Graskel Mendieta. Mendieta. He didn't play for Borough, though, did he? Am I going crazy? He played in the Premier League for a bit, I'm pretty sure. He did go to Middlesbrough, well done. Well done, Plute, that is a ridiculous show. Did <laughs> I it, was mate? Thinking, yeah, well done. Uh, the ones I had in my head were Victor Valdez, uh, Adama Traore, and Alvaro Negredo, the striker. Oh, mate. I can't believe but, Victor uh, Valdez played for Spain, uh, played for Borough, I forgot about that. Yeah, the yeah that was career. crazy. Yeah, but Mendieta, I think he's another player who's shot. like, he, he's like hero card territory on FIFA, I reckon. Might have to raise the uh, difficulty now with some more niche teams. Yeah, man. It's, it's crazy, isn't it? Like, I feel like I've got, got good ball knowledge and then your mind mm -hmm. just goes blank. Right, into round number two. I will start off with... Actually, I'm going to give me Belgium. There we go. That's the nice. random okay. generator. Okay, so um, you've gone for Belgium. So let's go for Premier League trophy. Someone who's won a Premier League. I will go Inter Milan. I'll go for Barcelona. I love Barcelona. We'll go Everton. Let's go for Fulham. Fulham, I like that. I was yeah. actually going to go for Fulham for mine, so... Uh, there you go. Glad Change you said up. that. Yeah. Um, I get to go first this time. I might just take the middle, to be honest. I don't blame you if you do. Yeah. There's about a billion players. I'll, I'll just go for uh, Charisma. Charisma into Milan. When yeah. did he play for Barca? Um, one only, season. Only briefly, yeah. Yeah, there's also Eto and uh, who else is yeah. there? Yeah, I like Umbra. it though. Got, you didn't take the easy option there, I like it. No, no, no. I go, Charisma, yeah. yeah. I think he flopped at Barca, didn't he? And then he ended up being a lot yeah. better in other teams. Mm -hmm. All right, well, I'll go, I'll go for um, Barcelona, Belgium, Thomas for Marlon. What a legend. I like it. I think that's the only one I can think of. I don't know if mm. there's any other Belgians there, to be honest. No, you're right. I can't think. Go for Belgian at Fulham. Moussa Dembele. Oh, mate. He was so good. He was brilliant. I love his FIFA cards. All his FIFA cards were like Hullet, kind of basically on a budget. That's what he was. Yeah. Like four star skills and just had a bit of everything. He was so good. And it's mad how, like, every Spurs player that ever played with him, whenever they're asked who was the best player in training, it was always Moussa mm -hmm. Dembele. Always. Yeah. Yeah. Quality player. All right. So you do need Prem title Everton to uh, block me off. I need an Everton player who's won a Premier League. That's easy. Wayne Rooney, mate. Yeah, he goes by the name. Wayne Rooney, what a baller. I love yeah. Rooney. I don't know what your thoughts yeah. are, but I just think it, he was so... Young Rooney, when he was like 20-odd, he was an absolute mm -hmm. joke. It's, it's kind of annoying that EA, like he's, he's got an OK icon card, but I just feel it should be a lot better than what it is Yeah. on the game. I just feel like they're... Uh... There's a lot of icons like that, though, like Thierry Henry as well. Mm. They've, they've butchered him when he should be quality. This is um, the thing, mate. I think as as um, 
as FIFA's progressed, like icons used to be the best cards five years ago, whereas now there's so many crazy promos, like icons don't have the same value anymore. That's yeah. the problem. Mm hmm. Do I know a Fulham and Everton player? It should be, because it's like the same kind of size club kind of thing. Um, yeah. Ooh, Adimola Luckman. Nice, nice. So. Never forget that terrible good. penalty he took. <laughs> Do remember that, actually. Oh, so, Fulham and Inter or Belgium and Prem title? Oh, that's tough. Fulham and Inter. You can probably yeah. do Belgian Prem title. Yeah, you've got you've got a very two good... way of winning. Yeah. Mm. Smart. Well, I mean, I might as well take the easy option: Belgium Prem title, Vincent Company. I was about to put Kevin De Bruyne. Uh, yeah. <laughs> we'll go Company. Both start with a K. Yeah. Um, so I need Inter and Fulham. It's a tough one, but I'm sure you can think of someone mm. with your expert yeah, brain. Be... Generally, just get like Italians at like Fulham and yeah. then kind of work backwards. Um, who's Italian? I can't really think of any Italians at Fulham though. Same. Oh, I do an actual one. Uh, Cedric, the right back. That's a very niche one. Like, the only reason I know that is Arsenal into usually, um, but he's obviously gone to uh, Fulham now. Oh, is he at Fulham now? Is he? Oh, I didn't realise. I think so. When did he go there? So I know he's, That's what I mean. He's like he was at Southampton. He was good at Southampton, Cedric, wasn't he? And then, uh... yeah, yeah, yeah. Six games for Fulham and Ooh. four games for Inter. Mate, that is that is a hell of a show. I've got to give you that one. Yeah, so that gets me the three in a row down the bottom. Some Takes the very interesting choices. Yeah, into round number three then is one all. I do like it when uh, we've got some good competition. Usually, it's just me steamrolling people. Yeah, um, come on. So... <laughs> like I said, I've got a realm. I've got a realm, mate. So it's a start. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Uh, what would you like to start off with? Can I throw Leeds in there again? <laughs> yeah, why not? He didn't Come have them on. on the last one. I'll let you have them back in. I'll go Chelsea. Yeah, I'll tell you what. Let's let's spice let's spice things up and go for a over thirty player. I might go for the. I might just go for the MLS um, as a league. So you literally can say anyone that's played the MLS. Oh, okay, okay. So, Smart. Yeah, yeah. Might go for a nation, random nation. Yeah, so generate if you want one. Go, go on. Generate me a nation. Let's see what comes up with. Um, as long get... as it's not too obscure. Kiri... Kiribati. I don't <gasps> know where that is. Yeah. That flags. It's like a tiny little place just off the coast of New Zealand. Yeah, I don't I'm know anything else from there. <laughs> Germany. Do you want Germany? Yeah, there you go. Nice nice big nation. Plenty of footballers from Germany. I'm going to go Monaco, actually. You get to go first. Well... I guess it's, this is probably the easiest one ever because MLS over 30, all of the good players that went to the MLS went there after they were 30. So Yeah, you should have gone like over 39 or something. Just... Yeah. Okay. But yeah. Oh, Still makes you have to think for the other ones, for the Monaco and Chelsea. No, no, exactly. Playing. Yeah, yeah. I'll take the middle and I'm not going to go with Zlatan. I'm going to go with David Villa because he was class. I love Lovely. David Villa. Yeah, great player. Loved his FIFA cards. Yeah, so oh. good in the early game. I'm gonna go Chelsea Leeds. Take your take your leads off you. Um Patrick Smart. Bamford. What a what a striker. Mate. I still can't believe Bielsa got him scoring 17 goals in the Premier League. It's unheard of. <laughs> I love Bamford. He was so good, but he's just so injury prone now. We can't rely on him anymore. I love him, yeah. but we can't. Mm-hmm. Yeah. What would you like? I'm gonna go for Oh, that's tough actually. Um over 30, Monaco. Um, who was their old goalkeeper? Subasic? He was quite old. Yeah, he was. Yeah, he is. Nice. At, uh, is he in the crowd? I think he's retired altogether now this season. Yeah. Um, I'm pretty sure he was late 30s even back then. So Yeah, yeah, he was. So let's put Subasic. Cool. I like that. Somebody who's not been on the series before. Um, let's go. Over 30, Chelsea. Plenty of options there. Hmm. I like I like doing niche ones though. Yeah, yeah. Kind of. Go on, give me a random third choice goalkeeper from Chelsea that's probably never played a game for him. Hilaria. There you go. Look, he actually can. <laughs> that's amazing. I'm pretty sure he was over thirty, wasn't he? Yeah. What, he's what a keeper he was. I think he's still there as like a goalkeeper coach. Yeah, he is. Probably. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, he was. Yeah, definitely over thirty. 
<laughs> so you need Germany, Chelsea. Well, I've got to block you off here. Um, mm -hmm. Plenty, plenty of options going. I'm trying to think if I can think of someone a little bit more. Yeah, a bit older. I, I could go. I could go like Havertz or Rudiger. I'm going to go for Michael Balak because he was a baller Michael at Chelsea. Balak. I like that. Yep. Just kind of shame again. His FIFA card just isn't that good. He's all right, but it's not. It's not what it yeah. could be really. I remember I got his moments on FIFA 21, like in my first. You know when they do the first icon moments pack, and you can get a huge player. And I mm -hmm. actually did enjoy him for a bit, but then he just turns like a bus. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> basically. Uh, so I need Monaco leads. Ooh. Mm. I reckon you might have one for this. I've got his face, but it's his name. That's the issue. Yeah. I'm sure his name was Augustine, wasn't it? The striker. For, for, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. The guy who we had the transfer saga over. And we basically yeah, owe them like 30 or 40 million or something for him. Fair play. That's a good shout. Maybe yeah, the, on loan from yeah, loan to Monaco and loan to Leeds. Oh. Maybe the worst transfer ever. I think he played like sixty minutes for us off the bench. We paid like yeah, twenty three. million for him, and now we owe even more because we've got to the Premier League. Mad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Crazy. Like there's loads like things like that where the technicalities. I don't know why teams like I don't know why the owners like even decide to do that because he wasn't even that good. Like I no. don't quite get the. Uh, he was okay. I mean, I don't know, mate. Back when Bamford literally could not hit a barn door, we signed, we signed this guy and I thought, he's going to be the next Ronaldo. But unfortunately, he didn't yeah. even play for us. What have we got left? We've got... So you've got Bamford's... Oh, I need to get a Leeds MLS. You do. Oh, no. My Leeds knowledge can't let me down here. Leeds MLS. I've got a couple anyway, if you don't know any. I can't, I can't, I can't be having it, mate. I can't be having it. Can't have me filling in the entire Leeds row. <laughs> no. Oh, yeah, you actually have as well. He's MLS. No, I will think of someone. Just give me some time. You will. You will. I will. I need to. I can't let my Leeds knowledge let me down here. I'm trying to think of like our mid-championship, mid-table championship days. I, think. I need to get this as well, don't I? I can't go. Yeah, yeah no, you've got me. Because that's how I win. Yeah, I'm sure it'll click for you. Is, is someone... Oh, mate, it's got a click. Are you thinking like old Premier League days? Yeah, yeah. Before you got relegated, and there's a well, there's another one. Oh, the guy. Oh, it's on. Right. This is taking forever, but I thought um, we had an American player called Eddie Lewis. Did he? Did he play in the Eddie MLS? Eddie Lewis. Do you know Please. what? He played for Derby as well. He did, mate. He was actually one of my favourite players back in the day. Yep, Did LA you? Galaxy. Well done. Oh <laughs> my god, that literally took me about five minutes. I'm not going to lie, but we <laughs> thought of someone eventually. Yeah. Also, San Jose Clash. Yeah, he had a few. Pro like, we we got you from him in the prem, I think. Yeah. I, I remember. remember I remember him being like our main man at one stage. Yeah. He was quality. Well, the ones I had were Robbie Keane. Oh, um, of course, Robbie Keane. And I, I did do a little joke with you back then, if it would click with you. Because where's, where's Click now? Oh, of course, Mateus Click, one of my favourite players. He's gone, he's gone to DC United, hasn't he, with uh, Rooney? Mate, I actually love Click so much. He yeah, was he was the quality race. for you. Well, I need MLS Germany just to stop you uh, getting that three in a row. Um, I'll just go Schweinsteiger, nice. which is always, I don't even know. That's a the yeah, most German be. name ever. Schweinsteiger yeah. is amazing. Do you know Germany Monaco? Just to fill in the grid. Um, Germany Monaco. Who have we got? There's one there right now. Kevin Volland. There we go. The goat. <laughs> what a what a player. So fed up. If I see him in another League One upgrade, I'm gonna uninstall the game. <laughs> he always gets like a special card each year for like doing yeah. absolutely nothing. Into round number four, then I get to start. Let's go for a World Cup winner. Oh, okay. Nice, nice. What would you like? World Cup winner, nice. Uh, I'll go with Barcelona again first. I always go... Yeah, let's go Fiorentina. I always go, like, both the Milans, Juve and Roma. So, let's go Fiorentina. Yeah, yeah. I'll rate it. I'll rate it. Borussia Dortmund. Go for Leon. Nice, nice. Final one. Let's spice this up. Let's go uh, left-footed player. Left-footed. Cool. Yeah. I like that one because it gives you an opportunity to put in a lot of players. I don't know what it is about lefties, but they just they just got this unique talent. Like they just look so much better on the ball. 
Yeah. Yeah, Messi does make it look good. Um, he's all right. <laughs> yeah, he's just all right. Well, Dortmund Fiorentina for the middle. Yeah, middle rows up for grabs, but that's a tough one. Mm-hmm. Wow. It's usually like, oh, do you know what? I've got it. It's uh, Jakub uh, Blaszczykowski. Wow. And that's only think... because of FIFA cards, because it just sticks out. Um, that's probably not how you spell his name as well. Um, but you know what it Blaskowskis. is. Blaszkowskis, <laughs> yeah. I know what you mean. Um, but yeah, I just remember him having a loan at Fiorentina from Borussia Dortmund. Do you know what? I think I've spelt it right. I Mate, know I that, haven't. I've, I've missed out a lot of letters in the middle. That is impressive um, ball knowledge, though, to be fair. I mean, I know he was in that prime Dortmund team, but um, I don't remember him yeah. being at Fiorentina. Well, it's like, it's like FIFA 15 to like 18. Yeah. Just playing the game like every day for whatever, four or five years. My plan was just to let you fill right. out the middle row anyway, because... Uh, All right. Just you, don't you... Know, you, you got the Fiorentina yeah, um, yeah, yeah. knowledge. Let's play it safe. Barcelona, World Cup winner. Another man who I absolutely love. He's got the ball packs like me. Andres Iniesta. Iniesta won the uh, World Cup for them as well. Yeah. With the goal. That was a great, that that year, like 2010, with the uh, South Africa World Cup. That was so good, man. Like, Shabalana. Yeah. I've enjoyed the last two, like the one in Qatar and the uh, Russia one. But I feel like the one, those two before that, yeah, in 2010 and 2014, which is so much more better. They were great. I'll tell you what, though. I think the um, the Winter World Cup was really underrated. Like, everyone just yeah. switched off from club football. And I don't know. I just think the more the more time goes on, the more we will appreciate that World Cup, I think. But I do agree the 2010 one was someone else. Mm-hmm. Yeah, let's go for another World Cup winning goal in uh, Mario Goetz. We've literally got the two World Cup winning goal scorers. Got to respect it. So you need Leon Dortmund. I need Leon mm. Dortmund. Oh! Okay. Oh, mate. That seems doable. Leon Dortmund. Yeah, I can't think of anyone Dortmund, Leon, so I'm going to go Barca, Leon, go for Samuel Umtiti. That's a good one. Yeah. Uh, there's Memphis Depay. And yeah. uh, what's the other one I had in my head? Pjanic, which is a bit of a... Well, he's basically oh. a player that's very good for this series because he has uh, a lot of clubs on his yeah, uh, yeah. CV. Does he, does he come um, up a lot, old Pjanic? Yeah, Pjanic is just like the most common because he's got Juve, Barca, Roma, Leon, and Besiktas. Okay, another one. Um, Fiorentina, Barca. Then, well, he's a very uh, big journey. He's probably the biggest journeyman, uh, Kevin Prince Boateng. Oh, of course, that's another one who's been everywhere. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say. Um, I was gonna say who's it? Sofian Amrabat. He's he's. Been rumoured to be signing for Barca, any but yeah, that's the thing. We 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 just wait for this video until he signs, and then it mm. looks like you know, yeah, throw him in there. <laughs> Remember, oh, I said God. it. I nearly said chat then. I'm too used to streaming. Um, <laughs> oh mate, La, La Foot Fiorentina. I reckon you could do that. Uh, so who've I got? Yes. Oh yeah. So you, yeah, left foot. You got two ways to win again. He's too good at this, isn't he? I do. Um, Mate, I can, picture, I can picture him walking out of my packs. I can picture his face. He's, He's the one who got the bottle thrown at him. At the, uh, well, the cop anyway, at the match. If you remember seeing that. Yeah, it's, um, Baragi, Baragi. There we go, Baragi. Yes, we got yeah. it eventually. Baragi, Baragi, whatever it is. That's it. I think it's something like that, isn't it? Yeah, yeah that's so that hard, right. mate. It was there. Well, yeah, that's the one for the left foot Fiorentina. Um, I think he had a Centaurians, didn't he? It was either an objective or... Yeah, he's always popping up. Something like that, anyway. Um, now, the big question is, can you think of a Leon Dortmund? Because if you can... Well, while you were thinking for that, I was thinking... I know it's a Spanish defender now. And I think his name is... Murray. It's like... That. Let me see oh, if that is right. Oh, But it's... Uh, that's mainly for thingy knowledge career mode <laughs> fair play what one of the young gems you signed that you turn into a 90 rated player it's not him he's not oh, the one is he not he's, right. only, he's only got Dortmund but there is a Spanish I can't remember his name though that's the thing do you know the left footed World Cup winner I, I know we're we're all thinking the same player here for a left footed World Cup winner and his name is David Silva <laughs> At least it's not an Argentinian one. I, uh, 
I nearly said Cap de Ria, but I thought, I think he won the Euros. I don't know if he'd done the World, World Cup yeah, in 2010. Yeah, I think he might have just, yeah, that's a 50-50 one. There's also, if you want 2006 Italian team, Grosso, the left back. Nice, nice. Penalty. Well played. So I need left foot at Leon. They're in massive issue at the minute, Leon. They have to make um they have to basically make sixty million in the next thirty days or something. Yeah. Or they're gonna get massive they'll, sanctions. They'll probably so finally gonna... sell that Awar guy who they've been Well no, the Awar's left on a free. He's, oh, he's not he's even gone, there. Is he? He's yeah. gone to Roma. Um but they've got Shirky to sell, probably. Oh yeah, he's their young talent, yeah. I'll say Phil and Mendy. Nice. Nice. Who did you have? Was that the one? I was thinking uh, Paqueta, because obviously we're just talking about oh, Fiorentina yeah, yeah. playing West Ham. Yep. That's a good one. Fair play. Right, into the final round. It is a decider. One all at the minute. What would you like to uh, start off with? Leeds United. <laughs> I'll go for a prem title. I'm just thinking of ways to spice this up. Could I go for like a position, like goalkeeper or something? Or Yeah, yeah, you can have goalkeeper. I Should like we do that. that. Let's go goalkeeper. Yeah. I guess. yeah. I'm going to say... Athletic Bilbao. They've never been on the series before, but they've okay. got a very interesting policy. With yeah, their well, transfers. They uh, they're specifically like Spanish players, aren't they? Am I right? Basque. Yeah, they can only they basically have to be Basque born, something like that. Anyway, that's amazing. I rate you though. So they can't actually buy anyone, but obviously yeah. people can buy from Bilbao. Yeah, I see. Let's go with Bayern Munich. I can go for the Turkish league. Oh, okay. Anyone that's played for like Galatasaray, Shiktas, whatever you want. Um, cool. You get to go first. That is generous. It's going to be interesting. So, so because I'm I'm on the show, I've managed to get first pick. I'll take yep. it. Goalkeeper, Athletic Bill Bell. Kepper. Kepper. You don't even get any nice Simon. If yeah, if you can even call Kepper a goalkeeper, but yeah. I go. still can't believe he's at Chelsea like, after the uh, cup final with Sarri. Oh, that's mad, like, isn't it? Refused to come off. Like that's that's just disregarding like what, like the fact that Sarri got the sack and not Kepa yeah. is ridiculous. You got you. That's like the number now. one rule in football: just respect your manager. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. crazy. Just completely. Yeah, because Willie Willie Caballero, he you know, he's a penalty saving merchant. Mm. That's what he does. Because I don't know Leeds Athletic Bilbao, I'm going to go Bayern Munich Athletic Bilbao. Uh, Javi Martinez. Nice. CDM. He was a legend, mate. He was so good and then uh, spent ages he at still plays. as well. He's in, he's in like the Qatari League or the UAE. Yeah, no, I don't remember. I think he was, yeah, he won the treble with Bayern, didn't he? He was in that treble one inside. I think so, just before he left, yeah. Let's change it up. Let's go uh, Turkish League leads. Another one of my favourite players, Ezgun Alioski. I loved him. Alioski. That's a good one. He, he was quality. Yeah. Uh... We've never really replaced him, you know, since he left as a left back. We've never really replaced him. Still only 31, to be fair. Mm. Yeah, I just remember it in the championship, especially. He was just such a. Yeah. Wait, he's a good player for your team, but playing against him, you're just so irritated because he's such a, you know. One of those <laughs> that kind of players who you just yeah, don't attitude, want. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Um, so I need Bayern Munich Prem title. Sadio Mane. Smart. Very smart. Mm -hmm. There's Mane or Sane. Yeah, and Sonny and yeah. uh, Cancelo, I assume, would have. I don't know if Michael Balak, I'm sure he would have put a prem with Chelsea, shouldn't he? Yeah, probably, actually. Yeah. That's a good shout. So I now need a Turkish League by Munich player. Mm. Wow, okay. Um, this is this is a wild guess, might be wrong. Um, yep. He's actually a FIFA 11 legend for me. I had his inform in my Brazilian team. Uh, Luis Gustavo. Did he play in the Turkish League? That's a guess. Might be right. I hope so. Yes, I think he's in. He's at. Uh, what's been... it with Ronaldo? Oh no, sir. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah, and he was at Fenerbahce before. Well done. Oh, get in there. Does work. The one I said. Uh, well, I said him earlier for Fiorentina. Mario Gomez. He played for Besiktas as well. Smart. So oh yeah. Said him. Of course. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Of course. You literally said it earlier, and I forgot. <laughs> Don't worry. That that happens a lot. Andy uh, was trying to work out. Liverpool into Milan and I said Coutinho in the round before and I told him that he played for yeah. Inter Milan and he just couldn't he, he took about 10 minutes to think of that so, so funny. it's always funny I remember um, him having Turkish, a silver card yeah Turkish goalkeeper uh, Muzalera nice he's been one of those goalies that's always played at the top level but he's never been snapped up by like 
a mm. top five league club. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. One of my favourite Spanish Leeds players, obviously along with Pablo, was uh, Samuel Saiz. I don't mean he played for Bill Bill though. No, let's go for Prem title Leeds. Um, Prem title Leeds. Uh, Eric Cantona won many Prem titles with United, but had one year at Leeds before. I can't spell. And a legend on FIFA for me, if you know, you know. Mm hmm. Well, I need. Uh... I don't think you'll know Bill. I don't know if you bluff me there with the Leeds Bill Bow. I genuinely can't think of end. anyone on my life. I genuinely can't think of anyone. If you can, <laughs> so just put me out of my misery. I don't know if what's his face. Oh, what's his, the goalie you had before? The Spanish one. From Kiko Casilla. Yeah, it could be a shell. Yeah, maybe. That's a great shell, actually. Yeah. Well, you can't win anywhere else, can you? <laughs> no, I can't. Goalkeeper yeah, prem title. It could be anyone, you know, just... But listen, for the sake of it, I'll go for that, and then we'll call it there. And then, if you don't know a uh, Leeds Bill Bow, no, I can't think of anyone, mate. Like I say, I, I could guess Kiko Casilla. He he might have done a spin of Bill Bill Bell. We'll go Kiko Casilla, but yeah. But technically, Marcel, Marcel if we could do managers, Marcel Bielsa has done both. Oh, I love him. My my, my <laughs> manager. Still, still don't know why he got rid of him. Don't get me started, mate. Honestly, mental. He's at Uruguay now, isn't he? Is their manager? Yeah, mate. I'm a Uruguay fan now, temporarily. <laughs> He'll get him playing some good football. Anyways, yeah. we, we, we've had a go today. We've shown some decent ball knowledge, oh, yeah. other than me yeah. with my five-minute wait. Sorry about that. That's all right. Yeah. I, I don't think there is one, to be honest. I can't see anyone performing Leeds and Athletic Bilbao other than Bielsa. So, uh, yeah, let us know in the comments if you know an older one. Maybe there is somebody out there. But uh, really? hopefully you did enjoy today's episode. Make sure you do go over to uh, Plate Socials, drop him a follow and all that good stuff. Drop a like on the video, and we'll catch you all next time.